Hello guys, this is Thomas and Friends and Spongebob Fan 2008 here once again and today I'm going to do my first content review and this content review will be on Carlos the Rubsy and Love Monster Fan. And if you don't know who Carlos the Rubsy and Love Monster Fan is, let me explain to you all. Carlos the Rubsy and Love Monster Fan is a user who bashes opinions on Love Monster and Bluey and he even treats um, Love Monster and Rawa Rubsy like they're the best shows ever. Even though I like Rawa Rubsy. And he even treats Bluey like it's the worst show ever. <sighs> and not to mention, he even made a sock puppet account called Rolly the Rolly UTTP Thomas and Friends Sucks. If you don't believe me, here's proof. See what I mean? That's because Carlos the Rubsy and Love Monster Fan is making a sock puppet account. And we'll do a content review on three of his videos. Um, his commentary on Sebastian the Doki and Mickey Mouse Clubhouse Fan 2K9's um, commentary at his rant on his show. Um, his commentary on Mark Dooley's rant on him and his rant on Sebastian's Clubhouse. So anyways, let's start the content review. Really? Mac the Year? Me? Really? Mac the Year? You just made a rant on me. Screw it. Let's start this commentary. Well, your commentary is going to suck, you opinion basher. Before I start this rant, I have two things to say. One, this video was meant for constructive criticism purposes only. Harassment or cyberbullying. No, you're a child good killer. How is he a childhood killer? Can you explain why? Besides, do you have proof that he does that? I don't think so. I thought that everyone who's going to enjoy this rant will be in socks. Nope, I'm not using the corruption term. But in my opinion, this rant will rock. Carlos the Wubsy and Love Monster fan has got to be one of the worst users on YouTube. No, you are the real worst users ever. Because you make some... Grounded videos on a lot monster on Kai Master. Dude, he can make grounded videos out of Love Monster whenever he wants to. It's his choice, not yours. And besides, and actually, you're the worst user ever because you keep bashing other people's opinions on Love Monster. Claiming that you don't bash opinions when you do bash opinions, making you a hypocrite right there. <sighs> Here are the reasons why I hate him. Better be good, or else this will get worse. In my opinion, one, he makes a lot of love monster videos. Yeah, that's why I made, and I had to credit the owners for BBC the worldwide family. Which I despise, love monster. That's not the reason. <sighs> well, I have nothing to say about that. Let's just continue with the content review. He makes a lot of commentaries, which proves he is a hypocrite. No, you think I'm a hypocrite? Well, guess what? I'm not a hypocrite. You are. Actually, you are the hypocrite because one example that you claim to hate um, 
when people bash your opinions, yet you bash the opinions yourself. This shows hypo hypocrisy you are. Well, guess what? Thomas the Foot says SpongeBob Friends 2008 praises Th SpongeBob SquarePants and Thomas and Friends like it's Jesus. You're such a hypocrite. Hypocrite much. Hypocrite. You claim that I treat Spongebob, Squarepants, and Thomas and Friends like the best shows ever, yet you treat Love Monster and Wow Wow Wubsy like the best shows ever. This proves you're a hypocrite once again. And besides, do you have proof that I do that? I definitely don't think so. Yeah, why are you going to hate it on the same thing? Builders is getting released. Four. He bashes people's opinions on love, monster. Well, I'm stop bashing people's opinions. Well, actually, you do bash opinions on love, monster, and bluey. Hypocrite. Well, I'm not. Actually, you are the opinion basher, so don't deny it. He needs to learn how to handle opinions on Love Master. Uh, you go fix your grammar. Well, like I said, not everyone has to fix their grammar, but I have. I have nothing to say about that. Ugh. Like, seriously, dude, not everyone's gonna fix their grammar. It might be hard for them. Mike, he makes a lot of grounded videos out of Bluey. Well, the reason why I did that because Bluey was a mean jerk to anyone in Froppy Town. Dude. Don't you realize that, um, Lo Bluey and Love Monster aren't real? Bes besides, they're just fictional characters. Note, I'm not using the fictional characters don't have opinions term because it's stupid nowadays. Like, what the heck? This proves that he wants a game. Well, say it. Well, at front, I really hate Bluey. Well, it's it's it may be be you will it well it may be be it may, well it's just maybe it's just your opinion, but in my opinion, I find Bluey to be the, be the best show ever. Six. He made call outs on me and other people. Well. And as for you, you just make ground if it was on a lot monster. As for Justice Academy, it's just cyber bully people on YouTube. Yet you cyber bully users all because they hate Love Monster. And besides, do you have proof that he does that? I don't think so. Anyways, let's move on to the content review. I did not take Unikitty in Battle for Dream and Mecha Builders way too far. I got Blow Lob Monster, Wow Wow Whoopsie, Pete in the Big Wild World, Jojo and Gragway, Hey Dougie, Gee, Gee, Wolf of the Wonder Dog, and Cars on the Road on H onto HBO. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Liar, liar, pants on fire. You do treat Battle from Dream Island and Unikey like the worst shows ever. Now stop denying your wrongdoings. I just admitted it, okay? I like Battle for Dream Island and it's my favorite object show. Eight. He takes me way too seriously. 
Why did I take you way too seriously? Well, you do take the, him, me, and the other users that hate Love Monster way too seriously because this proves you bash opinions on Love Monster and lo just lo just learn to handle opinions on Love Monster from now on. Because if not, then a lot of people will hate you. I can't handle hate and criticism. No, you can't. Like I said, you can't handle hate or criticism. Now, stop denying your wrongdoings already. Ten, and finally, he is a disgraceful bastard. And You're a disgraceful bastard. It's the other way around. You're a disgraceful bastard. Not him, you are. If you are watching this, don't you even think about doing a commentary on this rap? Sorry about well, that. I do it right now. Well, guess what? I'm doing a content review on this video, so deal with it. Because this video was made for constructive criticism purposes only, and if you do a disgraceful commentary on this, I will do one bad. If you do it! Yeah, I will dislike it! <sighs> this proves you are not handling hate. Although not... Although not everyone has to. You do another cringe and disgraceful commentary. It proves you can't handle hate and criticism. If you do it back, it proves you can't handle people's opinions on that monster. He can handle people's opinions on Love Monster. Besides, where's your proof that he does that? Huh? But anyways, those are my reasons. Do you know who likes this user? Wubsy. Wow, wow, Wubsy. And Fish. Well, I can handle their opinions on this user. And do you know who hates this user? Me, Mr. Bluey Studios. A squad brand 2023. Thomas and friends and SpongeBob fan 2008. And Sebastian Pidoki and Mickey Mouse Clubhouse Fan 2K9. Stop adding yourself in the hate spot! You have like Ted Nano Tom, according to my commentary on one the app the, the object for these videos. We all hate this user because he bashed it. I have nothing to say about that. Although I don't add myself in the hate spot. Do anyone who cares about copy rants? No. And plus, you're about to make a rant of Rock Monster, which Bruce can't handle people's opinions. <sighs> Bruh, it's just his opinion. And besides, he can't handle opinions. Unlike you, Carlos, and says the one who bashes opinions on turning red and love monster hypocrite much. And that red for you sucks because he gave all stupid reasons why he hates me. So I hope you enjoy this and my news. Don't you even think about commentary because I'm gonna do it back. So goodbye. Wow, just wow. That commentary was so awful. Why? Because he had some hypocritical reasons on this commentary. And now we are going to move on to the second video, which is his rant on Sebastian's clubhouse. So let's stop that video already. That horrible rant. Hey guys, it's Carlos from Whoopsie, a lot monster fan here. Sorry I did not make any rants in a while. I was too busy with all this stuff. Today's rant is all about Santa Ernst's clubhouse. To anyone who never heard this series, but that's fine. I can handle your opinion. So let's start. Santa's crop house has got to be one of your most rip-offs ever. 
How is it a ripoff? Can you explain why? And now stop making false ripoff claims. <sighs> this proves you act like Peter Peter Animate and Christmas Yes Sunny Day No. Even though that Christmas Yes Sunny Day No is a dead topic. Although I'm still ignoring Christmas Yes Sunny Day No. So about that. Let me explain you why. First off, this show rip off Mickey Mouse Clubhouse, which is way better than this. <sighs> Seriously, dude, that's a false ripoff claim. Just because it has the both word Clubhouse doesn't mean it's a ripoff. Besides, th th both of them have nothing in common. This show is about these dumb characters awful adventures. Suddenly was awful. How is he awful? Can you explain why? You just rip off Doki. Yeah? Bruh. He is not a rip off of Doki. Besides, he's just a Doki avatar. I don't know what these characters are, so I gotta leave it be. Anyways, this show was fake, just like Lot Monster Spy Show. How is it fake? Can you explain why? The animation was so awful, the theme song was a huge ripoff to the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse theme song, and the whole show was dumb. Well, well, for me, the theme song and the animation is great. And also, how is it a rip-off to the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse theme song? Can you explain why? And thank God it did not air on CBBS in the UK. Thank God he did. Bruh, that's disrespectful. Do you know who likes this show? So, hmm, he made that show. Well, it sucks. Do you know? Opinion basher much? Oh, who hates this show? Me and Walt, the real life Walt Disney. They wish you could get jumping to you to kill these characters. Oh my God, Carlos the Rubsy and Love Monster fan. Why would you send a death threat? You know that death threats are illegal and you can go to jail for that. And worse, if you ever done that in real life, you can ex especially go to jail. Or worse, face the... Um... Um... Face the death penalty. Besides, death threats don't work. Screw Santa Clubhouse and No, screw you. Screw Love Monsters Fire Show. What does Love Monsters Fire Show have to do with this rat? Even though I like Love Monsters Fire Show because it's hilarious. No, to anyone who look like never heard the show, but that's fine. I can handle your opinion anyway. The original Mickey Mouse cart cartoon was so many times better than this ripoff. Don't, dude, just stop making false ripoff claims. And I totally agree with you on Mickey Ma the original Mickey Mouse, but you still suck. And the rant. Do you have any requests? Comment below. And make sure to subscribe to my channel. And... Turn on notification bell. So goodbye. Well, that rant was awful because he gave out invalid. He gave. I mean, he gave out bad reasons on why he hates that show. So, anyways, um, part. Anyways, um, part two will now be in session. So, anyways, stay tuned.